the time off, Jeff. Six. Oh, it's going to be Buxton that's called across the skipper, and he's looking for something in his pocket. <laughs> is it handkerchief? <laughs> oh, he is a tease, isn't that's he? Twice you come out the side. <laughs> the, you came nice out the one. side of the mall. <laughs> nice that's it. I think that's that was a clear sort of <laughs> statement, wasn't it? Use it! Mata into a position to protect the ball and just give Shield a little bit more time and space. And it'll be put out by Wigglesworth. I think get it, but Glasgow steal it once more. Hastings over the top. Hall back penalty to Saracens. The crowd will cheer. They do not know the whistle is gone. The crowd don't know. The flags are waving. The celebrations go on. All to no avail. Look at Manawatoji coming in with their taunting celebrations of his own. Crouch! Inside the final five. It will be a Warriors free kick. In the early hit. Clearly balance, I think. So the French <laughs> players now pulled in by Doucetois and uh, Cadmore, who yeah. speaks a bit of French. Yeah, it plays Each dropping. He <laughs> plays at Claremont and knows exactly what he's doing. Cut. Hey, hop and away, hey. Benjamin Dambiel levelled it up at 3-3, only for La Rochelle to be undone by some quick thinking from Rassing. The restart taken quickly, and Sorelli Bobo just had to pick the ball up to score. Dominating like the Waratahs are at the moment. <laughs> Jack, Jack Dempsey with the atomic wedgie. Angus Blake, Blake saw the funny side of it. <laughs> <laughs> what a play! Or from both tonight, and Munster set their stall out with clean ball, and they go to the mall. And the referee sticks a hand out, and Munster continue that mall on. Second! Hold! And a little space in front of the stick, so I'll just chisel it there, but at some point, they've got it, you know, Put themselves right. out there and have a go. I think Ryan Conby is, is, the, is the one player who can Set. beat the first up defender. Ball in nine. On the five meter line, nowhere really for Leon to go. <laughs> a, little j a little bit of jiggery pokery. Okay, so we have to be a line out for Wales here. Yes. It's not a 50 22, okay? No. They carry back. No. Now we tell them, now, now we tell to the captain, Holly, thank yes. you very much. No worries, no worries. Tom Mutania actually arguing with the SNC coach for bringing the tee on. He wants to go for the corner, but you can see here the penalty is he's holding him in there, <laughs> right in front of the ref too. So, this is uh, the quick take by Mornay State. We saw an opportunity there there. potentially. Okay, so and there was a word like, from when I looked Yaku up, Pata that they could take it, but there were medical personnel who regathered as he now knock on is the call. Please reload. Four, reload. Ian Wright goes in. Use Someone's that. lost a boot, which has been thrown away unceremoniously by 20 metres downfield. Ward, Lang again, and Roberts got in the way and it went backwards, and it's a long run for Chris Cook. And Nate uh, Alan Brew doing a good job to make sure that Earl can't get there. Earl's fury. Cook scores. So goes across him. There is contact actually, that's the only thing. But he can run whatever line in support he wants. Peddy Wannenberg wanted to get up to defend and he was being held. He was being histrionic about it, but he was absolutely right. And I think that's what Roy Maybank saw when the flag came out on the near side. Ferris Burr is there. There's Wannenberg, no, number eight now. Look, look at Paddy Wannenberg behind him. He's going to go scores. down. Ferris is held. Nice two of them are held. Look at this. Hines has got two of them. He's got Wannenberg with his right hand. He's hanging on to Ferris with his left. It's an amazing piece of wrestling. It's the law, but I hate that. It's cheap. I mean, 
the ref will say you've put yourself in that position, then you get yourself out of it. For Sean Brits, a man who's normally a smiling assassin, he is not happy about that at all. Absolutely furious. He is anti, anti sportsmanship. Tempers starting to fray on the Italian side, and Aldrich lets them know. And New Zealand steal it back. But that can be the decisive score, but the Wallabies have come back from. It is now Bellamy looking at the crossfield kick. England to score the fourth. Oh, has Alex Wills finished it? The body language suggests he hasn't. Against a French defence led by Sean Edwards in 37 minutes. The good news for France. The ever dangerous Naituvi, five tries so far. Wow. I see Atanga going for that conversion, and one of the medics for Buffer Tonga side just rocking through casually, just seeing what's happening. I think the reaction from Cassie said it all, but yeah, I'm just having a cruise along and nothing's going to phase me too much. <laughs> Pepignon, Narbon and Bezier with his final as held as he converts. Has he got an off bend on this? He has! Bath within three points, <laughs> and Finn Russell, he's a brave man. He's a brave man, yeah, yeah, asking yeah, the yeah, shed yeah. to quieten down. And again, and now Leicester win it. Now the conversation is over, and Matt Scott sits the upset gods back down on their sofa. They're on the charge now, Fulcher up there, but it goes to Harpen, Harpen's over! And Harpen is over for the try! And what a moment! It's the hero of Cape Town! No huddles before line outs, quick sets at scrum time. Shot talks for Holidays are conversion. Oh, oh, this time, go Scotland. Good work from Duhan Vandenberger. This is astonishing. Down Cows scores. Oh, what a response! Yeah, and who was it who tried to tackle him and got swallowed up in the hurricane celebrations? But Bowden Barrett. Dave Denton and JP Peterson meets him well and something extra but a very very impressive covering tackle from Peterson of the scrum half oh no it's a hand in Peter Steph Dupoy from Mako Vunapola Peter Stringer decides that he's going to put the ball straight into the Leicester pack see doesn't always happen but occasionally scrum half's hands slip As you can see, there he goes, but it's straight under Dorian West's feet. Oh, from the back of the scrum, Mertens has. Now, can he get it up high enough? It's there, he's turned around, he threw his hands in the air, and Andrew Mertens may have snatched victory. 